for conditioning and stretching, um, Corey is demonstrating a, a strengthening and a conditioning drill that we use. It's called leg thrusters. And the idea is he's going to use do uh, each leg ten times. He wants to get his knee high against the wall. Then he wants to thrust it as far back as he can to help with his, um, his stretching and his, uh, his speed. This is a good thing to increase your uh, leg fiber strength and also to make you quicker. The next one Corey is demonstrating is what we call our leg flexor drill. And this is a great one to uh, increase your flexibility and it's also good for your vertical leaping. The idea here is that Corey is trying to take his leg and swing it back and forth as high as he possibly can. And you can tell that Corey probably hasn't done this drill in a while because he's having a hard time getting his leg up, but he's doing a pretty nice job with it. What you see here is our dot drill map, and there's five circles. They're about two feet apart. One row of two, then a middle circle, and then another. of running a hard quarter mile on a track. The last one he's going to do is going to flip. Usually you turn the same way. Corey's doing a nice job with that. And that's our dot drill. And that's something you can set up in your own home in the driveway. All right, next one Corey's doing is what we call backboard slaps. And he's going to slide between and the goal is to touch the backboard as many times as you possibly can. Okay? Now, obviously, a lot of people aren't able to touch the backboard right away. So you can adjust this at home to a height that's good for you. And then when you get to that point where you're slapping the backboard regularly, then you'd move on to another height. This is what we call backboard slaps. All right, this is something you can do at home. If you have a crack in your driveway or something along those lines, this is just a line jumping. And Corey's going as quick as he can, jumping over the line with two feet. Then he can alternate, and he can go with one foot. He can go with his left foot as quick as he could possibly go. And then he can go to his right. This is another good quickness drill and conditioning drill that you can do on your own in the driveway.